Good day and uh, what? Good day and welcome to today's class. All right. So for today we'll be looking into uh, the principle of isometric circle, which other people call what isometric curve. All right. So listen up, listen up, and listen up carefully. So I am going to advise you on your own uh, drawing sheet. All right. Provide a square box of fifty. Provide a square box of fifty. All right. Then divide each of the spaces in the square box into what into four equals. What I am actually saying is this: provide something like this, a square box of this, a isometric form of dimension what fifty mm, a square box of dimension fifty mm. Then divide into what four equal parts. Yeah, divide each of the box into what four equal parts. All right, divide each of the box into four equal parts. So after doing that, then we are going to have it in this form. So let's continue. Let's continue. So after dividing the box into what into four equals, the next thing is what you join. I am going to actually start my isometric circle on this particular plane. Yeah, you know on this square box we are having how many plane? We are having three principal plane. Yeah, I am having this plane. I'm going to call this plane A. I'm having this plane, plane B. Then I'm having what this plane, which is what which is plane C. All right. So let me start from plane B. I'm going to start from what from plane B. All right. So if I'm going to draw my isometric circle on this plane B, after dividing this particular face into four equal halves, the very next thing is what is to join the longest diagonal. Listen carefully. You do what? You join the longest diagonal, right? So my longest diagonal here is what is ranging from this point down here, all right? Ranging from I join the longest diagonal, all right? So the very next step is this. The very next step is this. So. I'm left with what this particular corner and this particular corner. So I'm going to pick from this corner to the half of this point here and from this corner to the half of this point. So take a look at this, everybody. So this is what I'm saying. Yeah, this way. All right. Then uh, this way. All right. So set to. Then I'm going to do the same thing on what on the opposite corner here. Yeah, I'm going to do the same thing on the opposite corner here. So join. Okay. So if that has been done, if that has been done, the very next procedure is what is to pick your compass. Yeah, pick your compass, right? I am going to place my compass at the very first corner here. Place my compass at the very first corner here. I'm going to extend it. You know. Uh, from this corner, this line travels down here, isn't it? So I'm going to extend my compass down here, all right? And I'm going to what? draw the first curve, all right? So which is this, as you can see, which is what? Which is this, all right? So I'm going to do the same thing on the opposite side also. So placing it here, then I'm going to what? draw. I'm going to draw, all right? So after doing that, wherever the junction is here, this is my first junction. This is my second junction. Yeah, where your line is meet, all right? The diagonal and the so near the meet. So you place your compass there. You place your compass there and extend this your compass to here, to the side here, just like this one. Just like this. And you want to draw. Okay, as you can see. So I'm going to do the same thing at the top here also. Just like this. Then I'm going to work. I'm going to draw. So that is my what that is my isometric circle on this particular plane. That is my isometric circle on this particular plane. So I am going to repeat the same trick. Yeah, you repeat the same trick which I did here. You repeat it here also. I'm going to repeat the same trick here also. After doing the longest diagonal, so from the edge towards the project, then you would the project. Then from the second corner, project and what and what project, all right. So having that done, you apply that same principle here, all right. So from this point, I'm drawing it. So then also from this point, yeah. So this way, all right. Okay, so then uh, the junction where the line is meet, right? The junction where the line is meet, which is here. Okay, from this junction, right? As you can see. 
perfect and also from this junction and also works. So the same thing is done at the uh, other plane here, which is plane A. So I'm going to join what the youngest diagonal. I'm joining the youngest diagonal. Okay. After joining the youngest diagonal, so the same way from the corner over there, you drag it downwards. From the second corner here, also drag it here. So then the next thing is just pick the compass, you pick your compass in the front. So on the other side also. Alright. So then on this junction here. That is it, alright? This is your principle of isometric point, alright? 